What's good, y'all? We're posting a fucking gym tips and a routine so you guys can go to the gym and be fucking animals. I'm saying you you lifting heavier every fucking time. You're getting strong as fuck. And, bro, you're going to get bigger because you're lifting heavier. So let's get it. Bro, before you work out, eat before you fucking work out. For sure. Eat some protein and some carbs. Bro, you can eat chicken. You can eat oatmeal. You can eat rice. Bro, you can eat fish. Yeah, you're gonna have a lot better workout if you eat before. Cause you're just gonna actually have energy, like, in your mind. Bro, your food is energy, so it's gonna give you energy. Yeah, so eat before you work out. Also, warm warm up before you work out. So when you go to the gym, bro, do like this stretches. Like, you know what I'm saying? Do this, bro, these. Stretch your fingers and shit. Do, do this. This is all... This is all gonna warm up your hands, your wrists, so you can just control the weight better and you're gonna be stronger. So let's go. So eat and warm up before you work out. Build up that energy. Bro, before you go to the gym, don't be focused on anything else. Don't be focused on a grill. Don't be focused on your friend. Don't be focused on video games. Don't focus on what you're doing tonight. Bro, focus on your workout. Before you go to the gym, your, your mind is only on the workout to lift heavier than you did before. Bro, trust me, when you have the energy, that energy, that high motivation, and you're getting stronger because you're, you're feeling good by doing all this shit, bro, you're gonna go to the gym and you're just gonna be, you're gonna be just fucking killing shit, bro. You're gonna be, trust me, bro, for real. So eat before you work out, warm up, stretch before you work out, and build up that energy before you work out. Bro, you can meditate too. That will also probably help you. <clears throat> yeah, also to get stronger, to get bigger, take less breaks when you're at the gym. Bro, literally take a minute break. If you're working out by yourself, type, keep track, like right after a minute, bro, get right into your set. And if you're working out with someone else, bro, go right after them. Don't be fucking around, bro. Go right after them and keep that fucking rotation, bro. Go. You guys are going to go ham, bro. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right, Tom. Hit him All up right. with that program. Yeah. All right, so this is the program we hopped on. For sure. This is the Bradley Martin, Bradley Martin program. Yeah, so day one. Oh. Day one is back. Day two is bent. It's chest and arms. Day three, we have a rest. Then four is squats. We have legs and core. Then we have push press and shoulders. And arms. And then we have a rest day. You can do cardio on that day or you cannot. It's optional. Then the last day is a rest day. <clears throat> Alright, so. Then. Um. I'm gonna give you guys the exercises now, so if you wanna write them down, just pause that shit right now. Alright, so we got, so on back day, we start off with deadlift, then we hit T bar row, then we get the wide grip cable row, so we, we get like the widest bar, and we do the cable row, and then we do the pull downs. And the next day is bench, which is chest, then we have. When, when you bench, it's not about doing your max weight. It's about repping heavier weight. Don't do like some light ass weight that you know you can get like 10 easy. Like do some weight that actually challenges you. So day two is chest. We have bench, incline, incline with dumbbells. Then we have decline chest on the machine. And then the last one is flies. You can do it with a dumbbell, a machine, whatever the fuck you want. On day two, we have arms as well. So you have dips, skull crushers, kickbacks, which you have the dumbbell, and then you like go straight back. <clears throat> then you have uh, bar curls, hammer curls, and then the wrist curls. Uh, day four is legs. We have squat, leg press, RDL, and then glute bridge. So get a bench. And then you get like a barbell, just set it up on like your hips, and then you just want to thrust it up, you know what I'm saying? Just thrust it up, and try to go as heavy as you can, because
because that's gonna build like your glutes, your lower back. It's mainly for like your lower back. Yeah, right. If you, yeah, we're good with that. Yeah, when you, when you're building up your, your lower back and you're getting stronger, let's say fucking deadlifts, you're squatting heavier, you're rowing heavier, bro, trust me, you're gonna be benching more because you're getting stronger. Yeah, so when you train legs, it's not just your legs, it's your fucking lower back, bro. That's gonna have you a lot stronger and you're gonna be more explosive on your workouts, especially deadlift, yo. You're gonna be lifting that shit like it's nothing. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And some stretches to do on on the deadlift day and the squat day, you're gonna do some hyper extension. It's gonna stretch out your hammies. And on deadlift, you can you can do like your own stretches, but these are like the ones for like the program. For the deadlift, you can hit lunges as well. And day five, this is the last day for the program. It's push press, shoulders, and arms. Which is standing push press. Then it's seated over overhead with the dumbbells. Then we have lat raise and then front raise. And for the arm workout this day, it's v we have the V grip pull down. So it's like a V and you push it down. Then we have the rope press. So you wanna go like down and then out. Uh, the, we have the reverse curl, the barbell. And then we have the wrist curls to finish that workout out. And before the, the stretch on day five, you wanna do some reverse flies. So like you wanna go like, like straight back, like on the, on the fly machine. <clears throat> And then uh, you can also hit some pull-ups to warm up as well. Push-ups too. Whatever floats your boat. Yeah, make sure y'all doing wrist curls too, cause your arm's gonna look bigger. But just from getting the dumbbell, no, you put it down on a bench, and then you just like on your leg, and you just curl it up like. But keep it straight, and just curl it up like that. But yeah, that's gonna build your strong. Yeah, or you can really be able to lift heavier weight. You can use like a bar behind your back and curl like that. But yeah, this has been seven minutes already. Bro, so you guys got you guys got the tips, you got the program, um, you got the work at the, the warm-ups, um some foods, bro, some breakfast that I eat, bro, get toast. I I get um Dave's killer bread. Hell yeah. Dave's killer bread. I get a banana, I chop the banana, I put the Dave's killer bread in the toaster, I chop the banana up. And when the toast is done, bro, I just put the peanut butter on that John John. And then I put the bananas up on that bitch. And then, bro, that shit is a treat, bro. Oh, so get that protein. It's not just healthy, it's carbs. It's good as hell. There's calories. You're getting all that shit in. And, bro, you could drink a fruit shake your next meal. Not a meal, but that could just be like a little snack. You know what I'm saying? That boosts your vibration. It's going to make you feel good. So, yeah, a shake that the fucking bread. Eat chicken and rice. Chicken and rice before the gym is good. After the gym, you can eat fish. You can eat eggs, oatmeal. You could eat any vegetables like potatoes, squash. Those are some carbs. It's gonna get you good. Get you fucking juicy, juicy, bro. Juicy. Oh, bro, how I forget, bro. Semen retention, bro. Look, we on that. What three, three months or some shit, bro? I feel like a fucking god, bro. Once I hopped on that shit. And I got, and I was been progressing every single time. I've been tracking my weight, bro. I've been going crazy in the gym. All those tips, the mindset before the gym to lift heavier, heavier every time. The food you eat, you gotta be eating more calories. The warm ups, everything I've been doing, this has been helping me lift like a fucking beast in the gym. But I hope this video helped you guys, cause you guys gotta be posting some shit and tagging me in that on the gym, like benching two plates, bro. If, if, Bro, hit me up if you're doing that shit. Tag me in that, John. I'm going to like it up. Put you on my story, okay? But peace out, fam. Much love.